Hi, this is Naomi Davina. And this is Israel, and today we are coming to you from Starfest, yes. America at DTC. That's why I am dressed as an ins- uh, how is it? Tan Real? Tan Real. Tan Real. It's not exactly like him, but it's kind of inspired from it. So. Yeah. And today we are coming to you with the very first episode of Was It Really That Bad? The little way of show where we take a movie that everyone says is bad or everyone said it sucked, and we try to defend it and answer the question of yes, it really was that bad, no, it wasn't really that bad, or maybe it was that bad. <laughs> and today we are going to be starting off, kicking off the whole thing with. Super Mario Brothers. Yeah. It's partly because it's the last movie we saw, and partly in memory of Bob Hoskins, who played the role of Mario Mario in the film. In which I didn't know he died when I was watching it. I found out the next day. I was like, oh my god. So, um, first off, good points. Uh, good points. Okay, it was really interesting in the middle. Like, you would get really drawn into it. Uh, it was really cool. Uh, other good points. Um... Well, I like the the storyline was pretty good. Yeah, and I like the way they um, worked in Yoshi. Yeah. The way they. Uh, That's where one of the parts yeah, where you get really into The way they worked in the bombs and the way they worked in like, the mushrooms and stuff, yeah. even though they kind of did change it a bit. Uh, but I really like that part. Um, I do like the part of what I assume was shy guys during one scene, I'm going to for you, but during a truck hijacking scene, I assume those are shy guys. And that's pretty cool they worked that in. Yeah. Um, I mean, it's a really kind of cheesy movie, so. It's, yeah, Good it's, points are kind of hard, but I mean I like it. I like watching it because it's like one of those movies where it just, you if you're bored, yeah, so you watch it when you want to be entertained, yeah, or background noise when you do your homework or something. Yeah. But uh, bad points were the CGI was horrible. <laughs> yeah, the effects were kind of yeah. bad. There wasn't any three movies. Some of the so. acting kind of sucked. So, yeah, uh, and that probably stands for the fact yeah. that John yeah. Luciano who played Luigi and Bob Hoskins who played Mario. Actually, still, they have to get drunk to get yeah. through some scenes. And it looks like some of them. It looks like a lot of times they didn't want to be in it. <laughs> yeah, like I said, it's very entertaining. I like the story, and I like the way they tried to work in the elements of the game into the film. Yeah, I also I, one good point too is I like it when she. Well, I don't remember anything. There was a panel. I'm just gonna say there was a panel where she was pointing like Duck Hunt. Yeah, the zapper gun. That was pretty that was cool. Kind of awesome, yeah. Um, like I said, Yoshi the Goomba. That's cool. They kind of worked it in. When the Goomba design, I didn't like, but. We'll the whole stone thing, though, I found kind of stupid. I didn't like that. So she means the subplot yeah. of the meteorite, which if you haven't watched it yet. <laughs> uh, subplot of the meteorite, that's all you need to know. If you, you haven't watched it, you know what we're talking about, you have it, then we want to ruin it for you. But bad points. Humanizing King Koopa. That was kind of cool, but yeah. in the long run, I found it kind of weird. The Goomba design. Weird. Todd's design. I did not like what they yeah, did to Todd in the film. But everything else was pretty cool. I, mean, like, I did like, I mean, back to the good points again, the way they made the an alternate dimension. The way they made an alternate Manhattan and the yeah. cars and everything. And the way they did kind of like a society was built. That was kind of cool. Yeah. So, yeah, it was kind of awesome. Uh, that whole scene thing where they, okay, I don't remember that. But there's something you have to do with apes and shit. That was kind of lame. When they turned, where they had the regeneration gun or whatever. Oh, yeah. Well, I hated that part because that was like really stupid. Yeah, it's like a stupid scene. Yeah. I mean, yeah. it, it can be funny, but it doesn't fit the tone it of the movie. It doesn't fit the tone of the movie, no, it doesn't. I mean, you don't, you don't have the, the devolution machine, but, I mean, it fits when it's in their yeah. realm. But putting a gun and kind of giving it to the Goombas and bringing it to the world because didn't fit. Because it wouldn't fit if they almost took over the world. Like, yeah. some, like, like some Avenger things, you know, they made it, like, big. But it was just only one stupid, yeah, just one, one guy. Quick sequence. Like, seriously. Uh, Second good point, I love the way they made the uh, fire flower balls he throws yeah. into the guns. Right? Just the oh, kind yeah. of bolt fly. Awesome, that was pretty cool. Yeah. Um, Even though I didn't like, I mean, if you want to turn him humanized, okay, he's humanized already. That was kind of stupid of what they did to him at the end. Oh, yeah. Koopa, well, yeah, that was really, it, but yeah. That was kind of a ridiculous end to yeah, it. It was kind of a disappointment. I wish it would have had an end more along the lines of the game. Yeah. Um, I did love the ending because the ending was kind of a little tiny bit more like the game. And then they had... Uh, after credit scene, really cool. Yeah. Oh, they do have an after credit scene to that one. It really has nothing to do with the actual film, but it's pretty interesting because yeah. those are two characters that were in there. But yeah, I mean, it was interesting, and uh, it would have been nice to see a second one. Maybe they could have made the second one better because yeah. that leaves you hanging at the end. Yeah, and before it's good, before it's bad points, it does have its good points. Yeah. I actually would really have loved to see a sequel to it. I was waiting for that for yeah. years before I realized they were going to make it. The thing about it is, is okay, I mean, uh, a lot of people hated it, but really, it, it really is kind of a. Uh, Okay, Interesting, movie, yeah, yeah. Dennis Hopper hated it, I said Bob Hoskins hated it. I've we're, talked to a lot of people at the con, and they're like, oh, it sucked, it's a stupid movie, it sucked ass, but in reality, 
Uh, I think the movie was meant to be the way it was. Kind of a little cheesy and stupid. Yeah, was, as I said, it wasn't early 90s movies. Yeah. It was just into the 80s era, so Even it was though, meant. Even though, yeah, they could have made it a little funnier and just did a little more things. I think like, they not actually, the end scene and not I that scene with the monkey. And, well, in my opinion, I think they should have lost the funniness. They should have made it more. No, of a, I mean, well, they should have kept it light, but lost the yeah. like, oh my because, god, we're gonna be yeah, funny now. The type problem stuff. is, is they may tried to make it too funny. It was actually very stupid. Yeah, that's so. what I'm saying. If they would have kept it like, if they would have kept it serious but light, like a light tone, rather than saying like, oh my god, we're gonna be funny now. Here's a funny scene. Then I think it would have been better. But I do like it. It is entertaining. It is one of my favorite movies. Yeah. I really like the cast. It is one of my favorite movies too. So I mean, it's one of those movies that you love to hate because you like hate it but you love watching it too it's like yeah. one of your favorite horrible movies yeah and uh once the annoyance of it though was making princess daisy the oh, yeah. the heir to the mushroom kingdom when i mean we all know she's not the heir yeah. to the mushroom kingdom she's from what is it how do you pronounce it again sarasalan i think yeah it which is. is kind of stupid because that means that the mushroom king was her father yeah which, which is, everybody knows that's princess peach yeah. So anyway, um, I think it was, it's one of those movies that are horrible that you do want to watch and keep your collection, so yeah. how bad was it? It wasn't really that bad. Yeah, so to me, to answer that question, was it really that bad? I have to say no, it wasn't really that bad. But as and I said, there is again, a fan base for it, so. Yeah, it's kind of, but again, that's our yeah. opinion, so. If you hated it, it you hated it, if you liked it, you liked it. Yeah, so tell us what you think about Super Mario Brothers in the comments below. Was it really that bad? Was it not really that bad, or was it a, eh, I might want to check it out movie for you. And if you want to review a certain movie, leave us suggestions again if in the comments. If you don't leave us a suggestion in the comments, we're going to be reviewing our next movie would be... If we don't get any suggestions, our next movie will be the 1997 film, Lost in Space. Yeah. Uh, that should be coming sometime next week, yeah. hopefully. School's going to get busy, but yeah. Tell us what you thought about Super Mario Brothers, give us suggestions, and we will see you next time.